my name is Wiffin and welcome back to Castaway Islands and it's been a while since I last uploaded a Castaway video as I've been doing a ton and ton of school work but finally we are back and as you remember from the last episode we arrived on the Helios Island and as you can see on the right hand side I have a ton of money now uh, that's because I got recognized as a YouTuber on this server and everyone just started donating so much money to me and now I have so much I could just skip all the way till the end and it's kind of ruined the game yeah so that's kind of a problem I'm what I'm gonna try and do is explore every island and kind of make as much money as I can on the island before I move over to the next one uh, because they do cost quite a bit, but with the amount of money I've been given here, I could get pretty far into the game. You know, I could skip like two, maybe three islands right now. And, you know, that's not going to be fun for anyone. Not for me, not for you. Uh, it just it would suck. So, uh, today I'm going to be exploring this island. Uh, but before I do that, I want to quickly show you that I have a bunch of cool stuff. That's because I was given... I, I don't know what I was given really, I was just given Elite, that's what it's called, Elite, you can see it down there in the chat. I was given Elite by the server of this mod, uh, of this map, sorry, ah, I'm not talking correctly. I was given Elite privileges by the owner of this server. There we go, got it that time. And what that pretty much allows me to do is it allows me to uh, level up a lot more quicker, it allows me to get some more money a lot more quicker, so then you know these videos aren't going to be very boring it's not just going to be me mining and chopping down woods and boring boring stuff it's going to be me exploring doing a little bit of that chopping down woods a little bit of mining all of that jazz um and you know it's going to keep the series fresh and exciting uh, when you do become elite you do get given a bunch of cool stuff and you get access to two new servers uh, I will be exploring those within the next episode, but today I want to check out the Helios Island. And, you know, I got given all of this stuff. A diamond helmet with protection, uh, unbreaking, a chest plate, leggings, all of this cool stuff. And I guess we're going to switch out uh, <laughs> our stone for our diamonds now, which is pretty cool. You know, it was like I was given a Nike sponsorship. It seriously was. They were like, hey, you're an elite now. Here you go. Have all of this cool stuff. And I was like, okay, I'm going to rule the world. Uh, so yeah, I guess we should probably check out this island and avoid the water because that's PvP. Thank you to the person who told me that in the comments. Uh, I think it was last last video. I'm not entirely sure. Uh, let's speak to this guy over here. Uh, this is Mabel Disguise, and we're gonna sell some items. So I guess we should probably sell uh, a bunch of this stuff here. We don't really need that anymore. Uh, there we go. We've got some money. Now, what's inside of this chest? Anything? We don't have a commission. Uh, I want to go and find our ender chest because I want to stick some of these diamonds and stuff in them because I really, really don't want to, you know, go into the water by mistake and die because that would be terrible and I'd lose everything. Uh, who are you in here? Sell items again. Um, ender chests. Ender chests. Are any about? I think there's one up here. Aha, there we are. Hello, Mr. Golden. Alright, so let's just stick all of this stuff in here because, you know, we're going to be using the diamond for a while now. Um, we also have fishing rods, some shears. Uh, I'm going to sneeze. Oh. Okay, it went away. It went away. It went away, guys. <laughs> I really thought I was going to sneeze then. Oh, God. Uh, this food, I guess we'd probably keep some in there just for to be on the safe side in case I die and I need more. Uh, raw fish, you can stay there and we'll keep some actual cooked. Why would I do such a thing? Stack them all, Jamie. And we'll keep a few of that in there. Alright, sweet. Um, The shears, I don't really know what I could use them for, so I guess we'll stick them in there. Alright, so let's go and explore this place. This is a pretty big island, you can see we've got all the way over there. Um, if we have access to a crafting table and maybe some wood, I could build myself a boat to get across the water quickly because I don't want to be caught out there and I get murdered. Oh no, there's a bridge. Okay, there's a bridge. Don't worry. I thought that we'd maybe have to take a boat to get across and we'd be pretty vulnerable at that point in time. So I don't want like six elite PvP guys to come out uh, <laughs> in their boats and just slaughter me. That would be terrible. 
There's another ender chest here with all of our stuff in. Alright, so the mine room. So I'm checking. Yep, PvP is still disabled. This is a really, really big island here. Very big. So we have the mines down there. We have the village. Uh, our rooms are down there. I'm not going to buy a room. So there's no point really exploring that area. Don't really see the point in rooms unless you've got so much money and you've, uh, and you've unlocked all of the islands. Um, I guess once you've unlocked your own island, you don't really want to... Why would you be coming back here, you know? Uh, people camping the bridge go around or use the boat. But I thought the bridge was PvP disabled. Okay, I'm very paranoid now. I've got all of this cool stuff. All of this stuff. I should probably. I'll probably be um, pretty safe with it all on. Um, okay, we can enter here. I believe. Um, yeah, I'd, I'd feel pretty safe uh, with all of this diamond armor on. I don't think people will be able to kill us very easily, but. I still don't want to be caught <laughs> with all of that stuff because if I lost it, I'd be straight back to wooden tools and it would just be terrible. Alright, so this here is a mine area where you kind of just go in and you mine everything that you possibly can. Um, you probably want to look out for the diamond and the gold and uh, emeralds, all of that kind of stuff because those are the high rated ores. Uh, stuff like coal isn't really that expensive so you're not gonna really get a good price for it cobble is pretty much you know wasted why do you want to be getting cobble but because we've got this demon pickaxe we have fortune 3 which means that if you were to you know destroy this here before you normally get like say one <laughs> you'd get one or two pieces of coal now you'll get like double that which is insane and really cool because it's gonna allow us to uh, you know get a lot of coal and stuff pretty quick which means we can get more mining get onto the next islands even faster whoa what is that oh god what is this a block of coal my lord I thought that there was just like a hole there and it fell into the depths of hell and I thought I nearly fell in it all right as I was just about to say before I got interrupted there by that coal um there is a link right here an annotation as well as a link in the description below where you can go and play this server you can come on and uh, every now and again I will tweet when I'm on the server and you can come and play with me uh, as well as various other youtubers who play on this server uh, what do you guys also think of the sound effects and music within this series because I spend quite a lot of time after I've recorded uh, pretty much just going around uh, adding in little bits of music and little sound effects to like ocean waves off into the distance and stuff like that I think it adds uh, realism I guess you should say to the series I think it is pretty cool um, rather than it just being me talking for like 20 minutes and doing stuff that's probably boring uh, so I just seem to be finding coal here maybe this is all that we can find at this point in time on this server maybe on the Helios Island they don't give you access to diamonds just because if you could you just mine here forever um, now I do know that when I got elite uh, the mod owner he I keep saying mod because I always review mods the server owner took me to an island which you do by like slash uh, go to or something like that to the island and essentially what you got was this really awesome place it was like this huge building that was a hotel and they had a large one of these that had stuff like diamonds in it and emeralds as I was saying earlier and I guess you probably go there next episode to mine just because you know that's gonna be a lot more efficient and worthy of our time than just getting lapis coal and blocks of coal but I guess this is pretty cool right now because as I said I don't really want to go completely OP with having these elite powers because like I said it's just gonna make the series pretty boring although it would make it a little more quick oh, what the hell all right they've been replenished so we can just go on through and get all of stuff here this is probably oh my shit I must be amazing for the mines to be replenished uh, when you're on the uh, when you're on the server with all of the diamonds, that must be insane. You'd be just like, yes, give me all of the diamonds, give me them all. You just go out and you'd be like pimping, like you'd be able to buy all of it, not buy, you'd be able to build all of this stuff pretty easy, especially with emeralds. But I don't think you can uh, sell those here on this server. I don't think any villagers are cool with that. I guess 
uh, I think that they're just there to buy and sell items. I don't think it's the usual Minecraft trading way. Um, if there's someone who knows uh, kind of like the rating of how these, uh, I don't know what you should say, how these ores go, um, I assume that coal is probably the cheapest here. Uh, with lapis being more expensive, I'm not sure if these blocks of coals are more expensive. I'm sure they're being more expensive than coal by itself, but is it more expensive than lapis? That's the question that I'm asking you guys today. So if you do know, be sure to leave a comment below in the description. In the description, say what? When could you leave comments in the description? All right, so I'm getting kind of bored of this now. I'm pretty sure that you've got bored of that. So let's move on to the rest of the island and see what we else we can find around here. And then I guess we'll head back to the village to sell all of this stuff that we've just uh, crafted here. Um, mined, I should say. Uh, let's head over this way here. Are these still... Check the PvP. Oh, PvP's been enabled. Okay. Alright. Scary time now. Scary time. Um, I see it. Should we rush it? Let's run. Okay, here we go. Hopefully no one comes and attacks us. Hopefully this side of the of the ocean is PvP disabled. Come on, run, 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 run! Oh, okay, and, it, and it's been disabled. Sweet. Okay, my heart has stopped beating like a madman. Ah, oh, I really hate PvP. Not when I've got all stuff. When it's like Hunger Games on like servers and you can die straight away. I don't really. I, I'm, I'm, you know, I don't mind dying, uh, just because. Okay, we probably keep some of this actually uh, for when we're cooking food. Um, but yeah, when I'm playing on Hunger Games, I kind of like. Um, I kind of like. I don't like it. I mean, I don't mind dying just because if I do, I just start the next round with a bunch of more cool stuff, you know? But when I'm playing on a server like this where everything kind of. Whoa! $800 there. Uh, where everything, you know, if I lost all of this, it would take me so long to get it all back. Uh, which is why I'm pretty nervous when it comes to this kind of stuff. Um, let's go and find a dude who does furnaces. So, Aww. Red Stallion, do you do this? Nope, you sell items. God dang it! Where is the guy who allows me to stick all of my stuff in a furnace? Because I want to cook uh, some food for me. For me. You seem like another dude who sells. There are too many houses that with people that sell. Do they give different prices? I wonder. Oh, okay, here we are. It's Ninja Grey. Oh my gosh, we're pretty low on food actually, aren't we? That would have been terrible if we got into that PvP battle over there. And <laughs> I didn't have my food because it wouldn't have regened. I would have just died on the spot. Okay, there we go. Let's just stick a bunch in there. That should be enough. So we've got four chickens roasting away. Um, what can we build? Uh, not much. Where is my... Here it is. Can we build anything in here? Let's take out this. Raw pork chops. Uh, yeah. Okay, and let's cook these. Uh, what I think there should be is, I guess, oh, I don't know. Maybe I'll go and speak to the server owner as I do know him. And maybe ask if we can somehow, magically, be able to smelt more stuff. Because I can only do one kind of uh, food at a time. Whereas if you look behind the actual smelter, he has like six furnaces and only three of them are activated you know you can't access any of them so it'd be cool if you could kind of like right click smelter smith here and see a bunch of these um all out in place and then that way you could you know just spend your day going around killing stuff and then just cook it all up at the same time that'd be really useful uh, i'm not entirely sure what those guys are doing down there um let's go and see what they're doing uh well he is cooking all of that. Uh, we're we'll going to check out these guys and see how much it is to get onto the next island. So let's head over. This doesn't go into PvP enabled, does it? Because I'm on the water, does it? Oh, no, it seems fine. All right, it's Remy Kins. Uh, so the next one is ten thousand dollars. All right, that seems pretty easy for us to get. Uh, so we'll probably go straight onto the next island soon enough. Uh, but let's just go and get all of our stuff. Actually, I'm not sure if all of our food transfers in between islands. That I wonder. Because if it does, then we can just continue going through to the next one without having to worry 
about wait this okay pvp still disabled we won't have to worry about leaving all of our food behind this island is really really big wait that's when we came from earlier on we don't want to go back over there we want to go over here and use our beautiful diamond axe to get some wood all right and here we are so oh hello pig i'm gonna kill you piggies all right so if you do want to see me do anything in this uh what hold up wow okay that's awesome oh because we have fire aspect when we killed this pig it automatically cooks the food for us oh sweet i totally forgot that we could do that awesome so we don't actually have to go around cooking a bunch <laughs> of pork chops now we can just kill cows now and just get loads of steak mm. Oh, okay, maybe not you, but with the pigs we can. Okay, this is really quick. Alright, so we're going to get ourselves some wood. I'm actually going to get some here and not spend it. Uh, sell it, should I say? Because I think it's good to have some wood for when you want to craft stuff. Because, you know, pretty much every Minecraft recipe uh, in Minecraft requires you to have wood. Whether that be for building tools, for sticks, or making bowls for food you know there's, there's so many uses for wood so I guess I should probably get a bunch of it N no need for it to run out um, I, don't pick it all up. I have I got 55 already wow this is so quick elite premium membership whatever this is is so incredibly good if you are playing on this server I recommend that you get it just because you're gonna fly by in this server it's gonna be awesome <gasps> someone's hacking according to the chat uh oh that isn't good uh, so yeah uh, come on the server, maybe one day you'll spot me hanging around and you can come up and scream Hey, how's it going? And you'll pop up in my video, which I think is pretty awesome uh, So that's one way that you can get yourselves onto my videos As well as others such as Mr. Williamo, my good friend Mr. Will You've seen him in a ton of my videos before I'll leave a link in the description to his series that he's also doing on Castaway Islands and he's Captain Slimebeard because he's been doing so many uh, episodes of Castaway Islands they've actually made him inside of the game uh, that is something that I plan to find when we get to the island I think it's the I don't know what island actually it is but there is an island where there's a big pirate boat and if you go on there you'll see a slime head and it's named after Mr. Williamo it's called Captain Slimebeard and that's so freaking awesome to get yourself named in a server that's so cool all right i think that we've got enough wood now i think we're gonna head back get ourselves uh meat and then see if we can get onto the next island and then yeah i'll end up the video there so let's head back here run along all right so we made ourselves all the way back here and we've got ourselves 34 cooked pork chops that's awesome we've got enough food to last us a lifetime so Thank you, Smelter Smith, and let's head down to the next island. Now, let's see if we can get on the next boat out of here. We're making our way home pretty fast right now. We're getting ourselves all the way back to London, England, and we're going onto the Jeb Island. So let's move on there, and here we are. All right, welcome to Jeb Island, and there's a little tiki tiki man over there. All right, this is pretty cool. What's the next island called? that flu island which is 25,000 we could go there right now if we wanted to but as I said we're gonna be looking around here and I guess we should probably explore because there are a few secrets hidden around and the more you go into this game the more servers you go through the more and more awesome stuff that you are going to find there happens to be a bunch of hidden stores and shops that uh, show have a bunch of different items that you can never get can't craft them and you can't find them you actually have to find a hidden store but thank you mr tiki tiki guy I like your little lies over here that you can click um yeah i think i'm going to end the video off here today it's, it's getting on pretty long now uh tell me in the comments below if you want to see longer or shorter episodes i could do like an hour episode maybe that could be a one-off or if you'd prefer me to do five to ten minute videos in future it's all up to you guys you are the viewer my name is Wolf and thank you all for watching. Be sure to smash that like button below. Goodbye.